My name is Adrian Gonzalez, and I'm the marketing coordinator at Villa. No, definitely. I mean, around whenever we have grand openings, there's usually um, a lot of energy around. Basically, this morning we had uh, two big things going on. First, we had what's called the rookie refresh. Um, refresh is a term that Villa uses when we restock some of the best Jordans and Nikes and other um, sneakers, and we basically bring them back and have them available at retail. Um, so, I mean, this morning we had probably a line of like over 100 people. And then we also gave away uh, free Villa $50 gift cards for the first 40 people online. Um, and that definitely drew a lot of buzz. <laughs> um, Facebook and uh, where am I? Uh, IG. Instagram. Instagram, what page? Uh, Villa page. I heard it from Instagram and Twitter. Where about my mom? <laughs> okay, who's Instagram? Are you Phillips? Um, I was walking through that. I'm going. Just walking through? Yep. I came yesterday. You came yesterday? One of my workers gave you a flyer. So y'all know that the street team is doing its job. We're giving out flyers, putting up boots. We don't we supposed to. Yeah, so basically um, the, the event was like a, a co-event with a brand called Cupcake Mafia. Um, Cupcake Mafia is a uh, women's uh, branded t-shirt line. Um, so they definitely do a lot of you know, custom items and t-shirts specifically for like that sneakerhead girl or actually just you know every any girl that just looking for a nice graphic t-shirt. What's up everybody, it's Fitchy and I'm here with Skittles. Skittles, introduce yourself to everybody. Hey, what's up you guys? I'm Skittles, the CEO of Cupcake Mafia Clothes. Okay, so give me your background. Well, originally I owned a clothing store in Cleveland, Ohio. Um, I really didn't like what the industry had for women's streetwear, so I had to make it. You know, we started three years ago. We're in almost um, 500 plus stores, including Sneaker Villa, which is one of our favorite accounts. So how did you get affiliated with Sneaker Villa? How did they come about? Um, so Sneaker Villa is one of the largest streetwear stores in Cleveland. Um, and we knew one of the managers there and they were like, you need to be sold here. You know, they seen us hustling. They seen us at all the events and they wanted our, picked up our brand. So we did events to launch it off in every Cleveland store. And from there, you know, we were in all the stores. That's what's up, that's what's up. So what do you think the outcome is gonna be with today at Sneaker Villa? Um, I think it's gonna be great. We work with Kiana Taylor a lot. Um, she's, you know, one of my good friends. So I think the response for her and Sneakers and Cupcake Mafia is going to be a good collaboration. So how did that happen with Tiana Taylor? Like, how did that come about? Um, well, she was a friend of mine for a long time, like back, you know, a long time. So they asked me who would we want to host our Cupcake Mafia event for their grand opening. Um, and also, we released a collaboration for No Boys Allowed, which is their campaign for their girls' uh, streetwear. Um, and we did an exclusive collaboration that's only available for Sneaker Villa. So they asked me who should we get to host, and of course, you know, it's Yana Taylor. That's what's up. I, li I like to hear that. A little young lady, you know, doing yeah. her own thing, her own company and everything. Definitely. So tell everybody where they can find you, what's your website and everything. Yeah, so our website is shopcupcakemafia.com. Our Instagram is Cupcake Mafia, just Cupcake Mafia, simple. And then same for Facebook, Twitter, everything. Okay, that's what's up. Go get Skittles, Cupcake Mafia. She out here doing her thing. Peace. <laughs> nice. Do you watch it? Nice. Yeah. Do you know why I stopped you with your fine ass? I was in a cut, you can't fly past Wish the way we met would have been different, yo But you was doing 55 and a 54 So pull over that ass, it's too fat A Ronnie King, that's in your ass, is blue black You, you, and I, I We a team, high five Long time, no me, who you been doing? I get overexcited under your influence Head in a whip, won't blink the eye Let you swallow what you really shouldn't drink and drive you know, my girl from Medea's Big Happy Family. Byron! Sound like a siren. You might think I'm crazy, but I'm serious. I think it's best that you know now. That when I'm with you, boy, I get this feeling. And I don't want to slow down. It's so unusual. I'm really 
really excited. I ain't gonna lie. That's my baby mama, the love. She don't know me yet. <laughs> but I'm really excited to meet her. Meet you. I don't know if she's gonna see this. But hi, girl. Hey. I got your sneak and you're gonna sign it today. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, you signed my snack bag. Like sneaks in the, uh, in the audience. So. Okay, cool. Yeah. You signed my snack bag. Just know this. Just know this. I am excited to see you, boo. And I got you a gift, too. You're gonna okay. see when I get it. <laughs> Just like a drug, you got me high Intoxicated, I got another DUI A DUI, a DUI My name's Adrian Gonzalez. Um, you're here at the newest villa location in Philly, 1416 Chestnut Street. Um, you definitely want to be here. If anyone knows about Villa, you know our motto is join the movement. So make sure you do that. Make sure you join the movement here at Villa. If you ain't got a dream, you ain't got nothing. A lot of niggas changed on me when I got money. Say it come with the game, and this is what I wanted. So I'm a hustle like the first time I got fronted for the love of the green. And the love of the team Put together a circle They couldn't come in between Went from laying in my pockets To using money machines I got my city back popping And they don't want me to leave No, they don't want me to leave But I gotta go and get it though Time is money And I'm on a mission though Poppy gotta eat Niggas shooting around my mama away Cops running my sister crib I swear I gotta find a way Try to touch a million dollars And I'm like a dime away Never asked a nigga for a handout I 